salut tout le monde, c'est Bobourse, on se retrouve pour la suite des péripéties de The Walking Dead. Je suis toujours à l'épisode 1. C'est la deuxième partie, mais je suis toujours à l'épisode 1. Euh, je viens de récupérer la gamine dans la maison, hein. Et le jeu fait des frises bizarres tout le temps, et ça me fait peur. Allez, dessin. J'ai choisi de partir deux jours. Je boitis toujours un petit peu. Faudrait quelqu'un pour me soigner. Où est Herschel quand on a besoin de lui Donc comme je vous ai dit, je suis fan de la BD, je suis aussi fan de la série télé. Ah Qu'est-ce que c'était Non Peut-être un truc à faire avant la barrière Non D'accord, j'ai cru que c'était la poubelle qui a... Ah Des gens Oh man Je leur propose mon aide. J'essaie de me la jouer gentille et sincère dans mes phrases. Bonne poire, quoi. Quoi Je ne veux pas dormir dans le house ce soir, mais je ne sais pas si je devrais partir. Qu'est-ce que mes parents viennent à la maison Je ne vais pas te laisser. Bon, on va aller dans un endroit sûr qui est proche, ok C'est une bonne idée. J'essaie de protéger la gamine coûte que coûte. Hey man! Je vais pas te manger. Je boitille un petit peu, mais je suis pas un zombie. On cherche de l'aide. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. La ferme, comme chez les Herschel. Euh, juste un type. Allez, je vais pas mentir. Some guy. Yeah. She's alone. Let's get going. Staying put for too long. Je vais pas lui mentir. What do you want to do? I. Allez. Allez. Et l'autre il ne m'aide pas. L'autre il ne nous aide pas. Il regarde... il regarde les zombies. Allez. Ouais, Clémentine, maintenant que tu es là, ça fait toute la différence. Just some guy. It seems like you've saved a bunch of lives today. Donc on arrive. Il fait nuit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Well, Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you, then. You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Well, he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? 
Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Bah oui, j'ai un petit accent de voiture. I'm doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Ah, c'est Herschel. <rire> J'avais pas fait le rapprochement. On va dire la vérité. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl? I was with the police officer. Je vais dire la vérité. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Par contre, on a que quelques secondes pour répondre à chaque fois, c'est hallucinant. En anglais, ça doit être horrible. Parce que je sais qu'en anglais, je pourrais pas la faire, la vidéo. J'arriverai pas à parler, à me concentrer, à traduire en même temps ce qui se passe, quoi. Donc, je pense que la première chose de demain, nous devons renforcer les fences autour de la ferme. Ça ne me semble pas nécessaire. Je ne sais pas ce que tu as vu à la télé ou entendu sur la radio, mais il y a des choses sérieuses... Shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. And if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such a thing. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards Macon, I suppose. All right then. It smells like Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Just like that. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Hey, get up. Mm. Oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. I am, Jim. 
We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Doc? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable trait lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! Well, he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Doug, oui, oui, me me. Priorité. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool. Duck and I will hop to it. Ali. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Regarde. Du coup là, on a l'air assez libre. On peut toujours pas courir. Ah, ça c'est peut-être l'objectif quand je fais R2. On peut toujours pas courir, d'accord. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Je vais te parler. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean, in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah. No, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. The government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could... Hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Nico, how's your son doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds, and Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See you. Seems like those two are getting along. Peux parler? You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Je peux parler à la dame aussi? Hey there, girls. Ah. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, um, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, 
It's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, huh? No? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. D'accord, là j'ai pas trop compris pourquoi je répondais ouais, pardon. Je peux m'approcher du puits ou je sais pas quoi. Je sais pas si c'est un puits. Oui, c'est un puits, je peux pas m'en approcher. Où est Herschel Je vais discuter avec eux un peu plus. Ah, une autre grange Combien de granges Ah non mais c'est la même D'accord. En fait j'ai tourné en rond. Donc j'ai pas vu Herschel. Donc je vais aller parler avec eux. Parler aux petits gosses avant toute chose. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. How are you doing, Duck? Good! I'm gonna drive the tractor! I'm the foreman! Lift with your back, Sean! How are you doing, Duck? Good! I'm gonna drive the tractor! D'accord, il se répète. I'm the foreman! Lift with your back, Sean! Donc je peux discuter avec Sean maintenant. Et l'aider. Do you uh, think this thing will keep him out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. Sean's still working on that fence. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. Oui, if you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh... I had to shoot one. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Um, not too close to my family. Oh. Well, they weren't in Atlanta, right? So that's good. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Ah, Herschel est là-bas. Je peux lui parler encore? Hey, Lee. Still need a hand? I'm good. Maybe go check on my dad in the barn. D'accord, allons voir Herschel.
How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. That's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? No wife. Uh, not anymore. I uh, think she's up in Virginia, maybe. Sorry to hear it. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. <laughs> Ça sent le roussi. Je pensais pas que je devais faire un choix. Oh, dans tous les cas, j'aurais quand même choisi le gamin. Got that ride to make it if you want it. Dès que je peux mettre pause, voilà, je mets pause. Et je vais m'arrêter là pour l'instant les amis, et on se donne rendez-vous pour la prochaine partie. Par contre, je fais des vidéos un peu longues, donc il faut que j'arrive à mieux gérer le temps. Moi bon, les amis, je vous remercie d'avoir regardé cette vidéo, et je vous dis à bientôt.